Hi, I'm Rich Green, Director of Instruction here at Tour Golf in Agoura Hills, California. Today I want to talk to you about pre-shot routine and how you can take your driving range swing to the golf course. So I hear from many players, how can I take my driving range swing to the golf course? I seem to get real tight when I get on the golf course. I get nervous. I got a million thoughts going through my mind. And the first question I ask them is, are you practicing how you're going to play? Uh, are you, you, when you're on the range, do you have a target? Uh, are you going through your pre-shot routine? Having a good pre-shot routine will be able to free you, yourself up. It puts you in a self-hypnotic state. I see too many players stand over the golf ball, waggle, look, and then freeze. And they're going through a checklist in their mind. Okay, I got what I got to do with their golf swing. And then they go ahead and hit. No one can play good golf thinking their way through their golf swing. You have to have a good pre-shot routine. And having a good pre-shot routine is, first off, you have to have a target in mind. And then behind the golf, when you're standing behind the golf, figure out what you want to do with the golf ball. You have to play golf when you're on the golf course. And then once you're over the golf ball, you're not going to spend much time. You're going to take your one look, one second, and go. That's how the pros do it. That's how they get themselves into the zone. And that's going to enable you to, to get build some kind of a rhythm through your golf round. Take a look at this next video and see the, the good pre-shot routine. We can learn so much from junior golfers. Here's my son, and he's going to go through his routine, take a couple practice swings, stand back behind it, not a care in the world, focus on his target. He's going to take his one look and swing. Even when it comes to putting, everything stays the same. The pre-shot routine is no different than your long game to your short game. You're going to take your two practice strokes, stand behind the ball, focus on your line, take your one look, and off you go. To recap what we worked on, number one, stand behind the ball and decide what you want to do with the golf shot. Two, pick a target. Always have a target in mind. Three, walk into the golf ball and be committed to hit the golf shot. Four, always be breathing. Breathing helps reduce tension. And five, once you are over the golf ball, take one or two looks at the target and then it's go time. I hope this helps. Now get out there and play golf and not golf swing. For more information about my golf instruction, you can contact me at richgreenwoodgolf.com. Thank you.